With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is two cells of EMF E1 and E2, E1 greater than E2 are connected in series to potentiometer for balancing length 625 centimeter. When the polarity of E2 is reversed, then balancing length becomes 125 centimeter. Then the ratio E1 by E2 is. Hence we can see here for let's say here this is our let's say potentiometer. Here this is our potentiometer wire. Now the question says let's say when E1 and E2 are connected in series. So this here is our E1. This here is our E2 and this is our galvanometer. Now here we can say this is our let's say balancing point given as 625 centimeter. So in balancing condition we can see here the current flowing through this let's say here arm will flow through this potentiometer wire. This current will not flow through the secondary let's say here circuit as the potential difference between these two points in balancing condition will be equal to potential difference between these two points. Now we can see here if this potential is equal to this potential. So we can see here there will be no potential difference across this galvanometer. Hence no current flows through the galvanometer. So in the balancing condition in a potentiometer we can say here there is no current flowing through the here secondary circuit all the current in the primary circuit is flowing in the primary circuit itself. So in this condition the balancing length 625 centimeter means we can say here from this point to this point the potential difference in 625 centimeter will be the potential difference across these two points which will be equal to E1 plus E2 as this is our balancing condition for a potentiometer. So the potential gradient in this case will be our let's say potential difference and potential difference is E1 plus E2 divided by balancing length we have here as L1. Now here the question says that if we let's say reverse the polarity of E2 that is let's say reverse the polarity of E2 and connect this to galvanometer. So this here is our let's say E1 and this here is our E2. So the net potential difference now will become E1 minus E2 as E1 is greater than E2. The question says E1 greater than E2. The balancing length becomes 125 centimeter that is L2. So here we can see that we need to find the ratio of E1 by E2. So we have here as E1 plus E2 divided by balancing length L1 is our 625 is equal to. Here this becomes our E1 minus E2 divided by here we have balancing length as 125. Hence we can see here on let's say simplification this result becomes our 125 cancel 625 by 5. So this comes out to be our E1 plus E2 we have here as 5 times we can say as E1 minus of 5 times we can say here as E2. As this ratio becomes our let's say 6 times E2 will be equal to we have here as 4 times we can say as E1 as the ratio of E1 by E2 comes out to be our 6 ratio 4 that is we can see here the required ratio is 3 ratio 2 that is option number 1 3 ratio 2 is the correct answer hence we can say 1 is our answer. For class 6 to 12 ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.